I want the Breakfast Burrito Club to kind of be just about a group of people coming together from different walks of life. Basically like the movie, The the Breakfast Club, for us it was something that we identified with because, you know, first of all, we all grew up in the 80s. The music, the soundtrack is stuff that we grew up with. And also like in the film, you know, all the kids in the, in the movie, they're all outsiders. Because, you know, like for us, we're like rebels. All three of us kind of live outside, you know, normal society. Me, myself too, I don't have a regular job. I just live this whole creative lifestyle where I'm trying to make money off my art. Bucky and Anna, they all do the same. So we all kind of have this certain chemistry where we, we respect each other because of the sacrifices we've made to do these things like the, the Breakfast Burrito Club. Bucky, you know, she is definitely always like kind of like the voice of reason. She kind of holds back, but she's always has like a, a quick comment. And it kind of brings that to the table where she's strong and she does what she wants. So I think like, you know, our listeners, I think they, they trip out on Anna because, you know, they she is something that, you know, a lot of women wish they could be. They could that they could be free to just do what they want. You know, we're we're jokesters, you know, but we still take the show serious. At least I do, you know. Um, and I think that's one thing where people could listen to us and it sounds like a whole lot of fun. It almost sounds like we're not working at all, but really it takes a lot of work to keep that going, to keep up just sounding funny, you know, because there's days where I don't feel funny. I feel like shit, you know, there's nothing to talk about, but, you know, I have to kind of rise above that and and kind of like guide people into this you know good vibration